Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosemary. This is Rosemary's You Rock Art. If you are returning, thank you. I truly appreciate it. If you're checking this out for the first time, I hope you stick around. Please consider hitting that subscribe button, like, comment, share, and hit that bell so you're notified anytime I upload a new video. Welcome to hashtag color with us you rock art. This is an open collaboration. Everyone is welcome to participate and I am your host. We upload our videos Wednesdays using the hashtag hashtag color with us you rock art and upload anytime that is convenient for you. We are coloring pages out of this coloring book. I ordered this from Amazon for $5. Uh, and so I just pick a page each week and we all have fun coloring. So I have lots to share. So I'm going to start off with the page that I colored this week. So I picked a challenging page this week. Uh, I had to do it in several sessions. I'd have to take a break, uh, you know, after so long because, um, as I mentioned before, I am visually impaired and I have to look at everything that close. So I can uh, strain my neck. So, you know, I picked one thing, went and took a break, came back, did another thing, took a break, and it did take me several days. So it was a challenging page. It was a fun page to do. Was it very relaxing? I'm not too sure, but <laughs> it was fun. Um, what I used to uh, color this page were um, uh, sh fine tip Sharpies alcohol markers and uh, maybe I might have used a jelly roll here or there so this is my page that I did for this week and I loved the bold bold colors so so cool all right so for next week I want to I wanted to pick something less busy yeah so I picked this page for next week give you guys a chance to look at that all right, so that's what's happening in that book. So in addition to coloring that crazy page this past week, I wanted to color a page out of another coloring book that I've had in my stash for a long, long time. But I didn't want to color in it because I wanted to uh, get some skin tone coloring pencils or crayons well now I've got both so now I can color in my Wonder Woman book I love Wonder Woman I have loved Wonder Woman since I was a little girl so what fun um, so what I did is I colored a page out of here I picked something simple so this is the page I colored I used my uh, colored pencils mainly and then for the Wonder Woman, uh, the word here, Wonder Woman and her band, I used a glitter gold gel pen. Yeah, it has to glitter and shine. And then my dear friend Kim over at Kim's Inspired Live does something really cool when she uh, participates in Color With Us, You Rock Art, and she colors her page. She puts a scrap piece of paper somewhere on her page that coordinates with the page. And I think that's such a cool idea. I did something similar. I put a sticker there, a Wonder Woman sticker. So that was fun. Now, for this collab, you don't have to do anything addition to uh, coloring in this book. You don't, but if you want to and you wanna share, by all means, feel free. I just thought that was gonna be fun now that I have my skin tone colored pencils and crayons. So that's what I did there. Uh, I want to share some other coloring books that I have in my stash. I'm, I'm getting quite the collection. You know, I just love to collect things. Um, I, I found this at the thrift store, and I'm going to be doing a journal out of the little golden book, I Am a Unicorn. <laughs> it's such a cute book. Oh, my gosh. So I'm going to add some pages uh, from this coloring book to that journal. And I like this one because the pages are bold and have a lot of spaces. So I think I can manage that. So I'm gonna be doing some pages out of this to add to that journal. Well, again, I found these uh, skin tone crayons uh, at the Dollar Tree last week. So, you know, I've been using those. Um, 
so I went back to the Dollar Tree this past week. I walked up there on Monday morning and um, I did that haul yesterday for Tea Tuesday. Um, since I have the crayons, I had to get the coloring book. That's just how I am. Yeah, I have a sickness. <laughs> so uh, will I be doing a lot of pages out of here? I'm not sure because the, the lines aren't as bold and they be and they can be kind of a little bit more busy for me so i'm not sure but since i had the crayons i had to get the coloring book yeah all right one more thing uh for this uh collab okay i hauled a set of coloring books um from dollar tree yesterday and i wanted to get a second set of these books I'm not sure what I'm gonna be doing with them but for myself a couple of weeks ago I got a couple of coloring books that are color by number and you don't have to use their numbers you can color whatever you want but I liked them because the pages were simple and the lines were bold so I got animals color by number and I found a second one not sure what I'm doing with this one I also purchased floral color by number. I found a second floral color by number. Put that in that pile. Uh, I found the, it's called Relax color by number and it has the palm trees. Got that one. Found that one. I thought that I had found four identical ones but I only found three, okay? So for my stack, I found the color by number patterns, and I believe it's color by number. Yeah, color by number patterns. So I still need to find a color by number pattern for that stack, that one's mine. And then I have another one called relax, color by number, and it has, I wanna, I wanna say it's another palm tree, ocean scene kind of stuff on it. I need to find one for that stack so I have to find these two for this stack here that I am not sure what I'm going to be doing so stay tuned because uh, in August I want to start using these coloring books in this collab in addition to using our large print one because we still have plenty of pages uh, in this book to work through. I think I kind of counted maybe 25 more pages, meaning 25 more weeks or something. But I want to start coloring in these books. So I still have to find the patterns and that second one, which I believe is this one. So in total, there are, well, I can't count, one, two, three, four, five. And I only have three in this stack. So two more to duplicate what I have in that stack. <laughs> Is everyone following? <laughs> Gosh. All right. Uh, I want to mention one other thing. On Friday, I am participating in another coloring collab. It is called uh, Color Your Stamps and that's the collab, hashtag color your stamps. It is hosted by Becca over at Becca JB. And I love this idea. A while back, my dear friend Annie over at Ann Creates uh, suggested, why don't you color some of your stamps? Because I have a lot of stamps, either clear stamps or heaven knows wood mount stamps. So I started doing that and including it in this collab, Rose, uh, Rosemary's You Rock Art. No. Uh, color with us, <laughs> You Rock Art. But now I'm shifting over to Color Your Stamps collab, and that's what I'm doing on Friday, uh, along with whatever else I do on Friday. So uh, take a look at that collab as well if you love coloring and if you have stamps that you would like to color and, and participate. So I do have something for this Friday for that collab and a big thanks to Becca for hosting that. All right. Wow. I think, I think that I covered quite a bit today. 
Uh, again, if you have uh, any comments, certainly leave them in the comment section below. <laughs> I love reading your comments and I try to get to uh, responding to those as quickly as possible. Uh, and thanks. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate it. Be safe, be happy, be positive, and you guys rock.